Today, we're going to take a look at the latest offering from the Jeep range of vehicles. Now, I'll tell you what, if early road tests have got anything to do with it, I reckon they've kicked a goal with this one. This rig is manufactured in Ohio in the United States. And with the build, they have cleverly introduced a bit of European design, especially with the interior. But more on that later. The new kit on the block goes by the name Jeep Cherokee Trail Hawk. A bit of a mouthful, but Jeep are confident that they have a winner here, and it's all to do with this little badge, Trail Rated. Trail Rated means it has five key components. Traction, articulation, water fording, manoeuvrability, and ground clearance. So, does it actually have all this? Well, I believe so. Now, they achieved all this by introducing select terrain traction. Not with just one or two settings to be able to cope with surface changes or road conditions. They came up with five. So there is no possible way that you could get into any sort of trouble when you're on your travels. Throw in electronic limited slip differential with rear diff lock, hill descent assist, rough terrain cruise control, and you come up with a machine that can wear the trail rated badge proudly. Now, the power plant has been reduced in size to 3.2 litres, and coupled to that is a whopping nine speed automatic transmission, which is a nice combination. And I can tell you, you will never run out of gears. Now, the ride is comfortable and the suspension absorbs the rough in its stride, while there's a nice balance for highway driving. Now, there is one small downside. It's these all-terrain tyres. Now, they are a smidge noisy, but you can live with that because of the quality and what they're designed for. Interior room is quite adequate, with the added bonus of having rear seats movable. Plus, the passenger seat folds forward flat, so you finish up with a space you never ever thought you had. Like using the front seat for those bits and pieces you never thought you'd get home. Under the passenger seat is a nice flat storage bin. Great for your iPad or maps. A deep glove box, a couple of sunny holders and door pockets that can hold a 600ml water bottle. Now the abundance of plastic has been reduced, making way for a more softer look with bold instrumentation. Soft feel finishes and contrast stitching makes the trail hawk a pretty good thing. And you've got to remember, it's under 50 grand. Now the all important leather seats are very comfortable. In fact, they are molded to stop you from rocking around. And more importantly, there's plenty of padding for those off-road excursions. This new Jeep has a host more features that I haven't mentioned. So, for the good oil, drop into John Hughes Jeep in Vic Park and check out one for yourself. Or click on to zoomtv.com.au.